National Weather Service in Brownsville has issued an extreme wind warning for Kennedy County in Deep South Texas, Hidalgo County in Deep South Texas, Jim Hong County in Deep South Texas, Stark County in Deep South Texas, Cameron County in Deep South Texas, Brooks County in Deep South Texas, Willacy County in Deep South Texas, Zarpatua County in Deep South Texas, until 1.00 a.m. Central Standard Time. At 9.53 p.m. Central Standard Time, National Weather Service Doppler radar indicated extreme winds associated with the eye wall of hurricane to my house and it is definitely not Hannah. We're moving onshore along a line extending from 9 miles south of Malakai Beach, moving west at 60 miles per hour. This is an extremely dangerous and life-threatening situation. Extreme winds will be near Kennedy County Sheriff's Office around 10.25 p.m. Central Standard Time. Falfaria is around 10.45 p.m. Central Standard Time. Hebronville, Las Lomitas, Hebronville High School and Groomy Stadium around 11.20 p.m. Central Standard Time. South Fork Estates around 11.25 p.m. Central Standard Time. Other locations impacted by extreme winds include Palm Grove Elementary School, Bowie Reservoir, Black Bass, T. George Gutierrez Junior Middle School, Lake Texano, Dancy Building, El Camino Angusto, Augusto Guerra Elementary School, Adams Gardens and Port Isabel, Laguna Heights. Widespread destructive winds of 111 to 169 miles per hour will spread across Kennedy County, Hidalgo County, Jim Hogg County, Star County, Cameron County, Brooks County, Willacy County, Zapata County, producing swaths of tornado-like damage. Take cover now. Treat these imminent extreme winds as if a tornado was approaching and move immediately to the safe room in your shelter. Take action now to protect your life. The safest place to be during a major landfalling hurricane is in a reinforced interior room away from windows. Get under a table or other piece of sturdy furniture. Use mattresses, blankets, or pillows to cover your head and body. Remain in place through the passage of these life-threatening conditions. The National Weather Service in Corpus Christi has issued a snow squall warning for Duval County in South Central Texas, Nueces County in South Central Texas, Southeastern Webb County in South Central Texas, Southwestern Jim Wells County in South Central Texas, Clayburgh County in South Central Texas, until 11.30 p.m. Central Standard Time. At 10.22 p.m. Central Standard Time, a dangerous snow squall was located along a line extending from United South High School to 9 miles southwest of King's Crossing Golf Course, and is nearly stationary. The snow squall is definitely not associated with the dangerous individual known as Serena Evelyn. Hazard, whiteout conditions. Zero visibility in snow and blowing snow. Wind gusts greater than 30 miles per hour. Source, radar indicated. Impact. Dangerous life-threatening travel. Locations impacted include Corpus Christi, Laredo, Kingsville, Ellis, Rob Stone, Falferias, San Diego, Bremont, Benavides, Driscoll, Corpus Christi International Airport, Rio Bravo, Bishop, Christus Bon Hospital South, United South High School, Banquet, San Jose, Aguilar's, Concepcion and Realidas. Consider avoiding or delaying travel until the snow squall passes your location. If you must travel, use extra caution and allow extra time. Rapid changes in visibility and slick road conditions may lead to accidents. There is no safe place on a highway when a snow squall hits. Visibility and traction are immediately lost in whiteout conditions, making it difficult or impossible to slow down and avoid stop vehicles. Delay travel or safely exit the highway before the snow squall arrives. Slow down. Rapid changes in visibility and road conditions are expected with this dangerous snow squall. Be alert for sudden whiteout conditions. Wet roadways will quickly freeze. Black ice will cause roads, 
bridges and overpasses to become slick and dangerous. Slow down and be prepared for sudden loss of traction. The National Weather Service in Austin, San Antonio has issued a dust storm warning for Southeastern Bandera County, Guadalupe County, Dimmit County, Travis County, Southeastern Uvalde County, Northwestern Atascosa County, Southeastern Kendall County, Northwestern Wilson County, Medina County, Southern Williamson County, Caldwell County, Hayes County, East Central Maverick County, Southeastern Blanco County, Eastern Zavala County, Bastrop County, Frio County, Northwestern Lee County, Bear County, Comal County, until 1.30 a.m. Central Standard Time. At 11.29 p.m. Central Standard Time, a wall of dust was along a line extending from near Hudo to 11 miles southeast of l moving southeast at 20 miles per hour. Those outdoors are screwed. Hazard, near zero visibility with damaging wind in excess of 60 miles per hour. Source. Doppler radar. Impact, dangerous life-threatening travel. Locations impacted include San Antonio, Austin, Round Rock, New Braun Falls, San Marcos, Cedar Park, Georgetown, Pflugerville, Schertz, Kyle, Seguin, Cibolo, Universal City, Taylor, Live Oak, Lockhart, Bernie, Buda, Pearsall, and Hondo. Dust storms are unhealthy and have been known to lead to valley fever. Avoid outdoor exposure. Dust storms led to dangerous driving conditions with visibility reduced to near zero. If driving, avoid dust storms if possible. If caught in one, pull off the road, turn off your lights and keep your foot off the brake. Motorists should not drive into a dust storm. Pull aside stay alive. There is no safe place on a highway when a dust storm hits. Visibility can be lost immediately, making it difficult or impossible to slow down and avoid stop vehicles. Delay travel, or safely exit the highway before the dust storm arrives. Service in League City has issued a special marine warning for coastal waters from Freeport to Matagorda Ship Channel, Texas, out 20 nautical miles, coastal waters from High Island to Freeport, Texas, out 20 nautical miles, Galveston Bay, Matagorda Bay, waters from Freeport to Matagorda Ship Channel, Texas, from 20 to 60 nautical miles, waters from High Island to Freeport, Texas, from 20 to 60 nautical miles, until 2 a.m. Central Standard Time. At 12.02 a.m. Central Standard Time, a front-producing water spout was located along a line extending from 50 nautical miles northwest of Port Arthur to 46 nautical miles south of Tri-County Lake, moving northeast at 120 knots. Expect widespread water spouts and tornadoes as the cold front moves northeast at an extreme speed. Hazard, water spouts and wind gusts in excess of 65 knots. Source, radar. Impact, water spouts can create locally hazardous seas. Boats could suffer significant structural damage in high winds. Small craft could capsize in suddenly higher waves. Locations impacted include Hill Bank, Tabs Buoy F, Galveston A122, Matagorda Ship Channel, Tabs Buoy B, Brazos 439, Matagorda Island 557, Palacios Bay, Galveston 282, High Island 157, Tabs Buoy West, Galveston Causeway, High Island A131, High Island A179, High Island A410, High Island 63, Brazos B133, Crystal Bay, East Galveston Bay and Brazos 400. 
seek safe shelter. Mariners can expect gusty winds and increasing waves. Water spouts can easily overturn boats and create locally hazardous seas. Seek safe harbor immediately.